So we're spending our anniversary grocery shopping. I have a confession to make. What does the lion say? Okay, you oh. I'm gonna try to put out three videos a week. <laughs> she does not like him. <laughs> Look, you can sit on my bump now. I was gonna curl my hair this morning and then Eloise woke up, so that didn't happen. <laughs> Miss Eloise woke up with a little bit of a nosebleed this morning. Can we clean you up a little bit? Were you picking your nose? Is that how it happened? She's been doing that a lot lately. She's been picking her nose. And it's really cute, but she shouldn't do it. So today, the day that I'm filming this, it is Wednesday, November 14th. I film these vlogs sometimes like a week in advance just because it's easier for me to edit it. We've been married officially for three years. Been together for six years now, which is such a long time. Yeah, those are spices. That's a mixer. Yeah. Zach is still working night, so we can't really celebrate tonight. And it's also a Wednesday, so it's not like we could do much anyway. So we're spending our anniversary grocery shopping. So fun. We'll probably go and get like a coffee or treat ourselves a little bit at least today. But we'll be celebrating on the weekend. Eloise is actually going to have her first sleepover at Grandma and Grandpa's house. And uh, Zach and I are going to go to a hotel for night and probably just like order in a bunch of food and be lazy because that's our idea of a good time. All morning I've been finding these super cute notes that Zach left for me. He's done this like once before. He never writes me notes or anything, so when he does, it's extra special. I've been finding little notes all over the house. I don't think I've found them all yet, but it's just, it's been making me smile all morning. It's so cute. We decided we're not gonna get each other gifts this year just because we are going out to a hotel for night. It's expensive. I'm on a budget and Christmas is coming soon. So in my opinion, notes are totally okay. This is what she's been doing while I've been talking. Mm-hmm, spices. Just as long as none of them open up, we're good. I'm just gonna make you some oatmeal. Guys, this this is how I cook now. What are you doing? Yeah. It makes it a little difficult sometimes. I have a confession to make. You guys think I'm this like amazing mom who has it all together all the time? Well, I'm not. In fact, I'm probably one of the most impatient people that I know, and it's not a good thing, and I'm not proud of it, especially when it comes to mothering. I tend to lose it very easily with Eloise. Something. I need to work on. It also means that I opened my Fat Pit Fun Box like a week ago, even though it was supposed to be included in today's vlog. Just can't help it. That box is so fun to get in the mail. It's like receiving a little present in the mail specifically for me. And how can I not open it right away? <laughs> yes, I have partnered with Fat Pit Fun for this video. I did this in fall and they reached out to me with their winter box and they're like, hey, do you want another box? And I was like, yeah, I really do want another box because it was so much fun the first time. Through the magic of editing, I'm gonna take you to my Fat Fit Fun winter unboxing. I just got the winter Fat Fit Fun box and I can't wait to open it, so I have to open it today with Eloise. Eloise is joining me for this. I thought it might add a fun twist to the unboxing. Do you wanna see what's inside? You ready? Three, two, one. Okay, hold up. I should probably explain myself a little bit before I get into this. So if you haven't heard about FabFitFun, which by now you probably have, but if you haven't, I'm gonna explain. So basically it's a subscription box. You get it four times a year, once for every single season. 
Inside this box, you get full size seasonal products, and they're always by really cool companies that are cruelty free. It's a really great way to try new products that you've never heard of before. Mm, is it good? The box includes all kinds of fitness, wellness, lifestyle, beauty products, everything that most women really enjoy. Each box is only $50, but everything in the box comes to a total value of about $200. So you're getting $200 worth of full-size products for only $50. Crazy. But wait, it gets better. I have a coupon code for you to get $10 off your first box. Just use the code Delilah when you order your first box. Pretty cool. If you sign up now, you get to customize your own box. So you get to choose between a variety of different products so that it's customized totally to you so that you can get as much use out of this box as you possibly can. Which I think is so cool. You should eat that with your spoon, honey, not your hands. Unfortunately, as an influencer, I didn't get to customize my box. So everything that you see in the unboxing is actually my initial reaction because it was a total surprise to me, which is kind of fun too. I kind of like that. But there is like one thing in the box that I probably wouldn't use, which would have been nice to be able to customize. It's a really cool new feature that they're offering. Anyways, let's get back to the unboxing. Did you hear that? I was like, oh. What is that one? She's just gonna pull everything out. What is that? Can I see? So the first thing Eloise has pulled out is a Brilliant Eye Brightener Highlighting Stick. Oh, it's by Thrive Cosmetics. Should we see what it looks like? That's pretty, hey? Wanna see that? Look, this is what it looks like. What is this one? An eye mask with hyaluronic acid by however you say that. Not sure how you say that. This is an unboxing with Winston too. Can you get me scissors? Slice that open. Zach is also here. Oh, cool. I have always wanted to try these too. There's four pack, four, five packages in here. Cool. I'm gonna need that when baby number two comes. All right, what else is in here? You pull out something new. What is this one? Two essential oils, eucalyptus and sweet orange by the brand Elevate. Is that pretty? You put that in the diffuser. You pull something else out. What is this one? Hydration Cream Mask by Ahaba. Are you gonna do that one with me? <laughs> pulling all these up. What is this one? What's that one? Oh, there's a headband and glove by the brand Bear Paw. Oh, this could be perfect for driving. Like these kinds of mittens. Cool, they fit perfect. And then there's also a headband to keep my ears nice and toasty warm. Can you put it on you? Oh, wow. Those are sockies. Those are super big sockies. Really cute over the knee socks. Gold Blast Dry Shampoo by Orb. Orby. Dry shampoo is a staple as a mother. <laughs> Ooh, pretty. <laughs> okay. Ooh, it's a blankie. Zach, I got another blanket. Oh, no way. The blanket that you see behind me, I just bought that today. And this one looks like it's similar, but gray, which is awesome. Like this. Yeah. Look at this. This is actually perfect. Yep, that's paper. <laughs> and the last thing in here. Plates. Is it plates? <laughs> and then, I don't know what this is. Let's see. Walking. They're fitness sliders. Oh, I think they're like, you put them on the ground, then you get like push up positions and do stuff. Yeah. yeah. So these are something for fitness, not entirely sure, but honestly I'm not much of a fitness person, but I do have a friend who might actually really like these. That's everything. You pulled everything out, including the paper. Good job. That was everything that was in my FabFitFun box. Eloise seems to be very much enjoying herself because she's been grumpy all day, and for the last five minutes she's been quiet and content, so that is a good sign. All right, I'm gonna go enjoy these now and I'll see you in the vlog. I gave her oatmeal for the first time in a while yesterday and she loves it. Oh, look at her chowing down on that. Good job. Also, we've noticed she's becoming left-handed. She's using her left hand now all of a sudden. Mmm. 
It's a good. Good job. Five minutes later. She ate everything. Everything. Every last crumb. Good job, honey. Oh no, is your nose bleeding again? Oh. Let's clean you up. Winston has to be the strangest cat I've ever known. I gave him treats and he doesn't even want them. There you go. Miss Kitty, silly. No, 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 no. Those are Winston's. Good girl. What does a kitty say? Good job. What does a sheep say? What does a duck say? Yeah. <laughs> what does a lion say? <laughs> what does a kitty say? You're so cute. Yeah, those are kitties. Well, he ate some of them. <laughs> Hi. Are we going to go for a walk? Yeah? Okay. <laughs> walk, walk, walk. Oh, well done. I feel like every single time I vlog, Eloise has learned something new, but I really want to show you what she's doing. Hold my hands. Going for a walk? Good job. Look at you. Oh, that didn't last very long. That didn't last very long. But she is walking just by holding onto one of our fingers. I feel like she's learning so much so quickly. Also, I don't know if she's starting to like cut her bottom molars or what, but she has been still clingy lately. It's been a rough week. She's been throwing tantrums constantly when she's away. And she's been so clingy. Like if we're standing somewhere and she comes up to us, she needs to be held or else she will throw a fit. And if we put her down, <laughs> she will also throw a fit. So I'm not sure if it's like, I don't know if it's a development thing she's going through something like that right now or if she's starting to cut her bottom molars i don't know like i've looked in her mouth and there's no sign of any more teeth in sight but i don't know it's been weird your behavior has not been very good young lady it's been a long week while she's content i'm gonna try and start editing this vlog i know i'm totally pushing my luck because this never happens for long but i have to take advantage of every opportunity i have so while she's busy, I'm gonna edit. I was gonna say something else, but now I don't remember what I was gonna say. <laughs> I remember what I was gonna say. I have been doing a lot of brainstorming for the Christmas season um, and all the videos I'm gonna be putting out. And I'm very excited to say that I'm gonna try to put out three videos a week, possibly more if I can manage it, but I'm gonna try and push out just like at least an extra video every week. I'm not doing Vlogmas. I'm sorry guys, it would just be too much. I don't wanna stress myself out, especially during the Christmas season because I really want to enjoy that with my family as well. Plus then I would be sacrificing the quality of my videos just so that I could put more up. And I don't wanna do that. I like the way I edit my videos and it takes a lot of time. But anyways, I've been doing so much like tweaking. You'll probably notice in this vlog that I kind of tweaked a few things like the titles and the colors of my title screens and stuff like that. It's really nice to have that change every once in a while and I feel like this is a lot more my style. Lots of exciting things are happening and I'm just on this like work high right now I guess. Like, all I want to do right now is just make videos and put them out and I'm excited to create and I'm excited to do all of this stuff. I'm gonna do my best to put out a lot of videos and with that being said, this may possibly be a bonus vlog. If I can manage to get this edited quickly, I will try and put it up this week. And this is how far I got. The first like two seconds of the video. Do you want to help mommy film a video instead? Yeah. Would that go over well or no? Daddy. Daddy's sleeping. Good news guys, I managed to film an entire video in one sitting never happens also this is my little video setup this is all the stuff you guys don't see in the videos it looks nice and tidy but the living room's actually a mess i've just got a super cheap tripod and all of these things are always linked in the description box of my videos so this is what i mean guys like she's so so clingy and and whiny mom will pick you up right away you just have to be patient many hours later Sorry, Eloise. <laughs> I didn't vlog in the last few hours just because Eloise was throwing a lot of fits and I didn't really want to 
vlog that and then she went down for a nap and I've just been editing so there's nothing exciting that's been happening but oh we just woke up and now Zach is home well he's been home this whole time but now he's awake let's get you a cheese stick want one of these Zach has also lost his voice. He's been kind of sick for the last few days and every single time he gets sick, he loses his voice, every time. But now that Eloise is awake, she's gonna have a snack and then I think we're gonna get going. Go grocery shopping because we have nothing in the house. Got my grocery lists. Let's see if this works. That actually works really good. I finally, finally bought one of these like dash cam things so I can put my vlogging camera on here while I drive. I used some of my birthday money to buy this and it was one of the best purchases. I'll link it below with the rest of my video equipment in the description box if you're curious. Got some hot apple cider from our local cafe. It's really good. It's been my pregnancy craving lately. <laughs> it's our anniversary treat and now I get to go grocery shopping. Eloise found the big snowman. <laughs> Can you say snowman? He's holding a candy cane. Last time Eloise saw this, she did not like it. Eloise, it's Santa Claus. He's nice. <laughs> she does not like him. Doesn't like that one either. Just the snowman. Round two. They don't have my granola. I can't, I can't, I can't reach it. Thanks. We went to co-op and to Costco. Grocery haul. 60 eggs. <laughs> We're gonna have stuff first soon, okay? No snacks now. Mushrooms, bananas, strawberries, asparagus, salsa, margarine, butter, cheese, sweet potatoes, coffee beans, spinach. We tried this Vietnamese pho at Costco and it tastes really good so we had to buy some. Yogurt, two loaves of bread, Christmas oranges, Keurig pods, and eggnog, of course. Now the rest of the stuff that we bought was from co-op. Soy sauce, milk, matchstick carrots, cabbage, green onions, baking powder, cornstarch, minced garlic, crushed tomatoes, Asian sesame dressing, sliced almonds for salads. I love these on salads. Pad Thai sauce. I didn't have my favorite granola so I went for the dark chocolate chunk instead of the peanut butter chocolate. Zach insisted that we buy these so we got crunchy dill, crispy, crispy minis, ketchup, and salt and vinegar. And then lastly I got a whole bunch of Rolos because we're actually going to my parents house tonight. Well, Eloise and I are going to my parents house tonight to do some early Christmas baking and we're making Rolo cookies. So if you guys are wondering, I buy Eloise's sleepers from Costco because it's just the cheapest place to buy them. They're not the cutest, but they're cheap. So I bought her some 12 month ones because she's probably gonna outgrow her nine month ones soon. Got this one with some two, those are two cans, right? Two cans. And I think this one's technically for a boy, but she can totally wear that. And that's it. Look what she did all by herself. <laughs> she emptied the contents of the diaper bag and stuffed it in this box. And then she got in herself. Oh, there you go. <laughs> You're just gonna chill in there for a while? Where did daddy go? Daddy. Did he go bye bye? Daddy. Daddy. <laughs> Look at this little 16 and a half week belly. This sweater doesn't really 
there we go. There it is, 16 and a half weeks. That's pretty crazy. <laughs> Look, you can sit on my bump now. See? Can you put this on your lips? And go like this, go. <laughs> <laughs> like this, there you go. Do you want a baby brother or sister? Do you want a baby brother or sister? Uh oh. What does a kitty say? What does a lion say? <laughs> what does a duck say? What does a duck say? That's right. What does a sheep say? Good job. Those are the four that she knows. We're working on cow and puppy at the moment. What does a cow say? Ma. She did it. <laughs> what does a cow say? Ma. Moo. Say moo. What does a puppy say? Okay. Puppy says ruff ruff. Oh, oh, oh. Eloise, come on. Let's put your shoes on. Eloise, come here. Do I have to come get you? Can you put those on? Good job. What are you doing? <laughs> okay. We've got Eloise up here so that she can watch what we're doing. I also didn't buy enough Rolos, so we just went to the store to get a whole bunch more. It's really late. Eloise stayed up two hours past her bedtime, so she was not in the best of moods. I'm gonna end the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed. I think this is actually gonna be a bonus vlog, so I'm gonna try and edit this and upload it hopefully tomorrow. We'll see if I can manage to get that done. But anyways, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. <laughs> You up in boom, 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 bo